Hello everyone and welcome back to another 100 days of making comics with me, Zabethi. Today is day 44. We might be partially joined by my dog who is currently chewing on something next to my door. So this video is still several days behind me. I'm trying to get caught up as fast as possible, hence the double video earlier in the week. Um, I will be doing another double video this weekend and then another double video next week and I think that will be us fully caught up. So primarily in this video, what I've been doing is furthering along the idea that I had. One thing that's really awesome about 100 days of making comics is if I work on something for 30 minutes and then go away until the next day and come back, I can change things drastically from what I had the day before, which I think is noticeable in this. At this point, I have decided that I want to extend the cover, not just from the front, but to the back as well. Um, so I've extended it by 200% and I'm starting to rotate some of those details into the back side so it goes seamlessly. I'm trying to continue getting the flow of the dark energy or the smoky, gross stuff that's swirling around them um, and make it look a little bit mystical while they still have the cards and the petals flying around them. Um, and I'm trying to make sure that extends to the other page as well. Pulling in some of the other elements, like the demon, was something I wanted to do early on, and you saw that in the face that I was struggling with <laughs> over a couple of days. But I decided that I wanted to just continue with the theme that I had already put out there, which is these creepy little demons behind or around the room watching. So they're creeped up over the side of a mirror once again, and instead of it mirroring like being on the other side of the mirror, it's mirroring the other side. So I took a little bit of a pun on the other side and I took it to a different level um, where the demon on one side is in front of the mirror and the demon on the other side is essentially the showing the reflection um, of the girls. <laughs> It's a little bit of foreshadowing, if not an outright, this is what's going to happen. <laughs> I know it's not terribly, terribly clever, but I am pretty happy with the way that it has worked out. One thing I struggled with was originally I wanted the demons to be two completely different demons, but I wanted them to look the same. And instead of having an eerie symmetry, I wanted to, them to just be similar. But in the end, I found that the eerie symmetry only added and since it's the back side of the cover and you won't be seeing both sides at once it's not going to be that distracting due to the symmetry anyway this is the last digital portion of the title or the cover after this i'm going to be working traditionally and then yeah of course i'll bring it back in digital for just some color fixes but this is finished as far as it comes to the primary layout Anyway, I'm gonna leave you guys with a little bit of music and I'll see you soon. It's easy to speak out about the way I live, but it's a 24 karat dream. No supermodel in my dirty jeans, but in my 24 inches heels. Your 
James Boy. It's such a funny way to tell me what you search in life. Well, I'm a mad woman. Sorry, I don't compromise. Mad woman, mad woman. Keep calling me a mad woman. Boy, it's none of your business if I'm a mad woman. for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please consider liking it, commenting down below, maybe even subscribing. It means a lot. I hope you're having a wonderful day, night, or morning, wherever you are, whenever it is that you're watching this. I will see you all tomorrow. Bye!